All right, here at the Expo with Shane Cottle. You sit 19th in passing points after you pass four cars in your heat race, but it lines you up on the outside front row of your qualifier. Really advantageous spot going into one of these. What's it going to take for you guys to call this a good night? Oh, yeah, we're, it's uh, definitely not a good place for, you know, passing points, but uh, we're just going to have to go out there and hopefully win it, and, uh, you know, hopefully that'll get us a decent spot for the, the A main, and, and then, you know, go from there. Seeing Briggs Danner uh, on the podium for this Meyer Rossi team on Wednesday, did that give you any extra confidence or even motivation to really make it a, a kick-ass week for these guys? Oh, yeah, yeah, no, it, it puts some pressure on me, that's for sure, but, no, he... Uh, Briggs did a good job, and this this whole team they're 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 awesome. So I mean, they put a good cars under us. And, you know, I think uh, we got a good chance of you know being on the podium tonight, hopefully, and and uh, maybe even making it into the big race Saturday. And I know circumstances in racing like things just go different sometimes. But what do you make of the amount of wrecks we saw in the heat races tonight? Well, there there was definitely a bunch of wrecks, you know, right before ours, but. Uh, it, uh, the track was just one groove, and everybody was forcing the issue. And you know, with like my heat race, I wish I would have had a yellow, but uh, you know, it helped me out a lot. But you know, we didn't get one, so we we'll just do what we got and, and uh, go from there and hope for the best. Yes, we catch Shane live on Flow Racing tonight, last prelim night for the 2024 Chili Bowl.